Hey there folks, Alec Boffinger down in Matitsi, Wyoming for the 26th annual Can-Am six-man football all-star game. Team USA comes in on a roll, having won 11 of the past 12. Canada not wasting any time this afternoon. Second play from scrimmage and high school teammates Hunter Barnstable and Cohen Chewinski hook up down the far sideline as Chewinski gives Canada a 6-0 lead. The U.S. answers back. Wyatt Tremblay of Du Bois, Wyoming, lofts it up to Walsh, Colorado's Leighton Jones, who picks it off the DV's head, 14-12 U.S. Now midway through the second quarter, and the points continue flowing. Barnstable rolls out and fires a strike to Matthew Morris, and that puts Canada up 28-20. But a good finish for the U.S. to the opening half. This is Hay Springs, Nebraska's Gage Mintkin taking the toss and cutting it inside as he pulls the U.S. within two, 28-26. And then the defense really began to step up for the U.S. Canada stonewalled on the goal line as Miami, Texas standout Hayden Thompson comes up with the fumble. And then just before halftime, the U.S. strikes again. Connor Rowden's stum out of Genoa Hugo and Colorado goes straight up the gut for six. It's 36-34 Canada at the break. And then Canada would strike first again in the second half. Morris pounds his way in from three yards out to put the Canucks up 10 midway through the third quarter but the U.S. then ripped off 31 unanswered points as this is Mintkin around the right end. U.S. offensive MVP strolls into the end zone and that makes three consecutive wins for America, 12 of 13 and a 21-5 advantage in the all-time series. From Matizzi, Alec Boffinger, MTN Sports.